the uh, blue gilt on camera right now is 131.6, and I think she uh, sort of completes the, the 131 litter. We've talked about several of them, and, and they've been really fun to evaluate. Uh, good pigs, uh, backed by a tremendous sow family, sired by Curly on the top side, and his boots uh, was so right to mention. Uh, we, we did sell Curly, uh, probably jumped the gun just a little bit. He's got a great home. Uh, in production there in Indiana, but uh, you know the curly pigs have continued to be the kind that we like, and uh, there's certainly still a lot of utility with that boar, especially seeing a litter like this. This is a very stout featured first litter trenches sow on the bottom side. Uh, she'd be a trenches uh, goosebumps dirty secret would go back to Carol's mom there on the bottom. Uh, tremendous sow family, uh, the kind of sow family that gives us a great deal of confidence. Uh, this one, you know, as you try to try to project or forecast uh, their show in point, I think you can equally spend as much time trying to forecast their, their value uh, as a female. And this one for the, the dimension that she has, the shape that she has, and, and still the ultra good look that she has uh, combined with that kind of structure, uh, that sort of, you know, and then all the other ancillary things that folks want to focus on today, there's a lot of value here, uh, regardless of what happens in the show ring. I think there's a lot of value in this one, uh, 131.6. Yeah, I would bet a lot of money that the dollar amount that it takes to buy her the second time will be greater than it is the first time. Uh, because this one not only looks like an, an incredible feed and show project, but like you just mentioned, uh, on paper and visually, one that looks like she'd be a Looks like she'd be a lot of fun to breed around. Um, and she's got the same kind of proportionality, bone work, and, and shag as what her brothers do. Um, but honestly, I think you could say this one's a notch more aggressive in terms of just her chest in, in terms of her chest width and, and, and the shape she's got to her edges up high. Um, probably just a nickel more advanced in terms of her body shape today. Um, but on top of that, still has the, the same kind of ideal skull and look up front. Uh, man, she's short and boxy and can motor. Uh, she looks like a lot of fun to me as a big one. 